a question we get is low hydrogen electrodes. How do I store them? When do I store them? Can I rebake them? When you get your container of stick electrode, um, I will use 7018 as an example, that comes in a hermetically sealed container, and that is good for, for a long time, okay? If, that, if you crack that steel cracks or you, you, you puncture that can, you wanna put that into an electrode oven at 250 to 300 degrees, somewhere in there. <clears throat> if you don't have uh, a lot of use for 7018, you're not doing a big jobs. We also have small uh, 10 pound ovens you can plug into that are 110 that'll keep your rods dry. If you really aren't doing a lot of 7018 electrode, we also sell one pound containers that you could use that up and not worry about them too much, okay? But if you're doing some type of code work, you're gonna to wanna to follow what it says in the, in the code book here, the D1.1. Um, or whatever code you're welding to will give you uh, rules on what you should be doing with your electrode. Uh, if it's 7018 has an R on it, that means it's moisture resistant. It could stay out for nine hours. After nine hours, you should put it in a oven, and again, at 250 degrees uh, to 300 degrees, an electrode oven. <clears throat> If it doesn't have an R on it, four hours. You should put that in an electrode oven. Uh, as far as rebaking them, uh, there's a, depending on what you're going by, whether it's A5.1 or 5.5, you're gonna have different, uh, uh, different recommendations for different rods, okay? So 7018 may, could rebake it up to three times. Once that coating starts to flake or seem like it's not quality as it was when you first got it, you want to discard that. Uh, usually you're going to put that in. I'm not talking about your oven in your house. You need an oven that's 800 to 900 degrees, and it's got to sit in there for one hour. Okay, that's how you rebake them. Uh, I, think, I believe 8018 in the code book, uh, I think it's only one time rebake. That's it. So th there's some ideas on how to rebake and, and store your uh, electrodes. For additional guidance, look in your manufacturer's consumable catalog. They'll give some additional directions for you.